This is a case of a 35-year-old male. He presented about six weeks after a work-related injury. He uh, works at the airport and a metal tow bar weighing about 150 pounds fell on his left foot, essentially right on the dorsum of the midfoot. He had a fairly sizable hematoma that I was able to evaluate in the office and we used ultrasound essentially to irrigate it with saline and try to drain whatever blood was within that hematoma. So this is an interesting case of a 35-year-old male. Uh, presented basically as a worker's comp related injury where a large metal piece of equipment fell on the top of his foot causing this fairly sizable hematoma. He came to me about five or six weeks into the injury. We did an ultrasound which showed essentially a hematoma right under the skin, right above the extensor tendons. Hard time extending the third and fifth toes. It's kind of sitting right on top of his extensor tendons. And he was having chronic pain with this hematoma. It was making it difficult for him to walk and basically just move his foot freely. Here we are in axial view. We're comparing it to his MRI. You can see the metatarsals, and you can see the extensor tendons essentially right underneath the hematoma. And again, this is where ultrasound is useful because we can avoid injuring these tendons during the aspiration slash irrigation. some of it. Right, just a mm -hmm. So here we are, we're using a 16 and a half gauge needle, the biggest one we have. That's our best shot to try to get some of the fluid out, which mm -hmm. I anticipated to be quite thick. And here we are injecting just saline into it, trying to loosen it up with the needle and break it up and see whatever remaining blood we can get out of it. And you can see how close we are to the extensor tendons. Okay, and we went through this process a couple times, again, to try to get as much blood out as we can. And also, just the pressure of the water can perhaps break up any scarring within that area. We did some subsequent acupuncture therapy on him as well. How's it feel? You're about two weeks better. after. A lot better than before. Yeah? So, yeah. Hurts less when you walk? Oh, I'm a lot less when I walk. I'm able to kind of move my toes more than I did before. Here we are at six weeks, and you can see that hematoma is starting to get a little lighter, uh, consistent with some solid tissue forming in there, but it's certainly smaller. Also, you can see how close you are to the vascular structures right underneath it. And here's just a comparison, six weeks compared to pre-procedure, and certainly much smaller, and it is organizing. And here we are five months out, and again, it's shrunk even more, and... Uh, it still has some hyperechoic signal within it, but a lot better. And here's just the serial images of pre-procedure six weeks and five months. And we can see that the hematoma has drastically reduced in size.